Leaders in Douglas County expect you to take questions this morning from people living there following new legal action the county is taking when it comes to immigration. Yeah, big deal. Fox 31's Courtney Fromm has more this morning. The meeting expected to start around 10, right, Courtney? Yep, and our crew here right now, my photographer Kyle and I, we're going to head in there around 10 o'clock when all of this starts. But we do know that Douglas County confirming to us this morning that El Paso County has now joined them in a lawsuit being filed against the state over immigration laws. And it's kind of a big deal. The lawsuit, which challenges two laws that dictate how law enforcement can detain undocumented immigrants. One of the laws banning local law enforcement from working with the federal government to detain and arrest undocumented immigrants. Now we know Doug Co leaders, they have been super vocal about about this and especially to bus companies carrying migrants to not stop in Douglas County after an emergency ban it passed earlier this month and they're even slapping on some fines of, of up to thousand dollars per person with any uh, bus uh, caught unloading in an unscheduled spot. We want to be very proactive and make sure that these bus companies don't think well we'll just bring some people to Douglas County because we have no shelters in Douglas County. Yeah, this is, I think, I believe the third or fourth meeting they've had about the migrant situation. Like I said, it is expected to start this morning at 10 a.m. here at this Douglas County building off of 3rd Street in Castle Rock. We are going to head in there. There's also a way for you to virtually participate um, online. I believe Douglas County has that link uh, for, for the WebEx um, on their website. But for now, live in Castle Rock, Courtney from Fox 31. All right. Thank you, Courtney.